two teenage debaters go to Harvard and come home champions. They went up against teams from all over the world. You know, it reminds me of a very popular movie Absolutely. with Denzel Washington. Uh, not only did they crush the competition, they made history doing it. CBS 46's Brittany Miller joins us live in studio. Brittany, I can't even imagine. They've got to be on cloud nine. Oh, you know what? They are so excited. And we are too here, of course, at CBS 46. At just 16 and 17 years old, their names are now in the Harvard history books. They're hoping this victory, though, paves the way for other teen debaters here in Metro Atlanta. Opponents have made the argument that the E should not join the BRI because of an increase in protectionism and a loss of invasive species. Companions. We give you a 1% risk of solvency and they give you problems that they do not solve for. Competitors. Especially tuberculosis, which accounts for seven deaths in Europe every hour. Champions. Rising Atlanta seniors DJ Roman and Keith Harris just met 10 months ago, getting accepted into the Harvard Diversity Project. It's a pipeline program that recruits black students and sends them to debate at Harvard. We applied to the program knowing that it would end with this tournament. An annual competition where Roman and Harris would face great debaters from 15 other countries. It's crazy that we're, we're going against like people with 10 years of debate right. experience or like five or three like and we just came in there with 10 months. Then they made Harvard history winning all 10 of their debates. These Atlanta teens were undefeated. We didn't recognize that we were making history while we were breaking history but like I don't think it sunk in yet. When I was debating and I was winning like I didn't really realize how big this accomplishment was going to be. Founder and CEO of the Diversity Project, Brandon Fleming, echoing that same feeling, saying the message attached to this victory is bigger than the win itself. To show people, to show the world what black children are capable of doing if they're only given access and opportunity. What an amazing story. Again, congratulations to them. I do want to tell you a little bit more about the Diversity Project. About 25 students are accepted each year. To qualify, you have to attend a high school here in Metro Atlanta. Now, they've already selected teens for next year, but don't worry. You can get more information on our CBS 46 app, Sean. Imagine kiddos <laughs> are like, I want to do this, Mom. I want to do I, it now. It's very impressive.